What's up, bitches? It's 9 a.m. Ready for some psycho dots? I'm ready. I got up this morning and I was like, gaming. Time for gaming. No time for sleep. No time for food. No time for bitches. Gaming. Got some cool mattress art here. Very nice stuff. I don't know if that's like the bottom of a bottle. I think it is. There's like bottles coming out of the smoke. I thought there was like a clock in the bottom right corner, and I was like, what's up with the clock? I just never realized that's the bottom of a bottle. Anyway, also one of the wisps of smoke coming out of the milkman's mouth kind of like makes him look like King Hippo. This is really cool stuff, though. Uh, going to continue the Psychonauts 2 adventure. Get that volume up. All right. And we're going to continue. I think my current plan is to get all the achievements in this game. I don't know if I will follow through on all of that, but I'm at least going to try to 100% all the mental worlds. That should be doable today, I think. We just got the three kind of like huge mental world levels to do. I think, from what I recall. And then there's, uh, of course, some overworld shit too. And I'm going to have to replay part of the game. <laughs> so... That should be fun. Okay. Ship it to be. Now. Press any button. I'm excited to like fuck around in some of the other worlds too. Uh, okay. Resume. I don't know, I don't remember exactly where I was. I genuinely could not tell you. Uh, oh, is there no... You guys can't see the game? That sucks. Hold on. Uh, easily solved. Thanks. All I needed was one message. Instantly. Hold on. Wait, actually, hopefully that did solve it. Yeah. First fucking message that came through, I instantly zoned in, solved the problem. Okay. Uh, so this one we already did. Um... So, I, I guess just go to the teleport guy. This world is kind of barren. I, somebody, I heard somebody say that, like, the last couple worlds in the game were not so great. And I kind of get what they're saying. It's not terrible. But it's, uh, it's not amazing. Disgusting. All right. <clears throat> what do we got? Let me open up my uh, thingy here. Yeah, so we got Psy King's level. Let's just go ahead and do that straight away. And then Bob's Bottles and Caddy Cassie's Collection. Caddy. 
Hopefully we can get all these done today. I think that's a reasonable goal. Doesn't matter if I go the wrong way because I'm just making more money. I want the money. Uh, let me know if that's a good volume and everything. And uh, thanks for letting me know that uh, I had the fucking Psychonauts 2 capture thing just not viewable. I don't want to bother the feast during their encore. The feast. Feast of the senses. Like I didn't even really pick up on that. That was their name. I have an itch in my ear. Hold on. I saw that fish, that fish figment, but I have an itch in my ear. Just bump the mic. Uh, so I wonder if these are figments that got bumped out of some uh, weird interstitiary segment that I've forgotten about, or if these were just always sitting here. Um, it is going to be real easy to miss figments in this world because it is so bright and colorful. Thankfully, one thing that I noted straight away from seeing the first trailer... Oh, hell yeah, they're all just bowing. That's awesome. Uh, was that the figments are more visible in this game. So, okay, now that we've played the game, this guy's auto. Hamburger helper is auto. That's forward, of course. That's Helm Nut Bear Ass. This, I think, is supposed to be Bob Zanotto. That's Compton Bull, and that's Cassiopeia. Which, it sucks, because audio, Cassio, it would have worked perfectly, but no. And are the, the audiences still Nyx? Oh, damn. Oh, look at that! The colored hand. That's amazing. Wow, I never even, I don't think we ever got to do this. That's incredible. I love that attention to detail. I guess it's just colored water. Uh, I don't suppose there's... yeah. They're pretty fucking liberal with the invisible walls in this game, unfortunately. Not a big fan of that. Oh, hello. Also, there's just like constant audio tests going on. I'm in hell. I'm in hell. I'm in hell. <sighs> this is dumb. Hold on. Oh, slick. Very slick. I had an idea and I executed it actually like weirdly perfectly. Can I get on top of this thing now? Yeah, nice. I, I had a feeling I wasn't going to actually fall through it. I had a feeling there was just going to be nothing up there. Wow, this is great. I love getting to places where you're not really supposed to be. It's just fun. Uh, look at that, like, there's like two mouths overlapping and Z fighting in the distance there. Can I get on top of that? Kinda doubt it. Oh! What? You want, mate? So I can go... over there. This is good, this is good. Shenanigans. <gasps> no, I fucked up big time. Oh, that's... okay. Rip. God damn it. Oh, it put me back up here, yes! This game is the best for that. That's that's one thing that's actually really in your favor in terms of getting jank. Okay, there's still a big-ass invisible wall there. I bet you can stand on those plants, too. This is great. I mean, I'm loving this. I've collected, like, one figment. Oh, can't stand on it. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to get over there. Could I get on top of the helm nut? That would be a good goal. I was kind of hoping to see if I could, like, get out of bounds back there, or, like, stand on those hills, you know? Oh, that's a big eye! I never even realized the sun is a big eye. Uh, give me one more shot at this, actually. Come on. No, I have an idea. I have an idea. Uh, people have told me that I missed the dive by not doing a, uh, there's, like, a dive move that I have not known was in the game. God damn it, not even that worked. I was thinking maybe if I do the switch to the ball thing. I, no, uh, there's apparently something that I just didn't do that uh, in the like campground area with one of the family members that gives me the dive. I, I never did this. Oh god. Okay. Well, it's been an exercise in failure. I had a, I had a little bit of fun. There's an invisible ceiling there. Cheeky bastard. It just, those speakers almost look as though they're supposed to be platformed upon, you know? I'm kind of getting annoyed at the sound. But I want to fuck around a little more. 
Wee. No. Oh, what the fuck was that? Don't roll like crazy. Rabu roll. This one's easier to climb up than the other one. Get on top of that. Fuck. I think this will be doable. Nope. No, it will not. Oh, shit. Whoa. Oh. Hachamama, Hachamama, Hachamama. Whoa. I'm in hell. I'm in hell. Okay, is it time? Is it time to stop fucking around in this area? I think it's time. I had fun. <clears throat> okay. So I need to go touch the field mobile. I don't think I missed any figments in here. Oh, this, this people said this world was kind of a nightmare, and it's like a huge world, and it's hard to see the figments comparatively. Okay. Oh. There's also the little teleport guy, I guess. Were there any figments I missed in this segment? Because I think there were some in this overworld. They're not kibitzing now. God, it's so weird. I'm uh, at least the Nicks are still there, but like some of the like some of the worlds, it's just like they're so empty when you go back to them. Okay, let's just do it. Oh, instantly we've got something I can do. It was not doable before. That's just okay. That's just a bit of a shortcut too. Um, okay, so 237 out of 263. We're really not missing that many. But we are missing some. I'll try to be thorough. But, uh... It's a big-ass area. Uh, whoa. music in this zone is great, at least. I, I mean, I like this area, it's just, uh, for 100%ing purposes, it's gonna be weird. No, invisible wall. Why did I... Why would I expect otherwise? Okay, check the main path. Pretty thoroughly. I heard someone say that the Shire theme, there's like... There's a riff where I noted that it sounds like the Shire theme. And, uh, they were like, oh, that's intentional because Elijah Wood, dude. I don't know if that's intentional. I could be wrong. It, I'm, I'm gonna sound dumb here, but I, I don't think I ever noticed when I first played through this particular area that the colors on the trees and the logs were moving. And these plants have, like, a slight wobble effect applied to them. That's a common thing to get plants to look like they're billowing in the breeze a tiny bit, is they like distort them a little bit in games. Isn't there a game that has like... The plants literally don't animate at all? It's like Skyrim or something, or like Fallout New, New Vegas or some shit, and they actually look like pretty decent because they just wibble wobble the image around. Okay. Um, all right. Eh. I'm not, I, I haven't been seeing much. We saw like a couple figments in that open area. Right, look, there's even... The fact that these are logs is kind of a hint to the fact that you can time slow the ones on the, uh, in the, in the whatever, the mysterious area. Questionable zone. No, I know, I know it's the questionable area. Sometimes... Sometimes I, like, intentionally say the wrong thing. That's like a Germa bit. I like to think I don't do it quite as dumbly as Germa does it sometimes. Or he'll just, like, change a letter. But I've noticed that I kind of do that, too. Oh yes. A thing. I'll be taking that one. Funny joke that I came up with. Oh. I think I accidentally skipped that by uh, just jumping straight up to the vines. Here we are climbing on Helmut Fullbear's uh, pubes. I believe this is where we found. Uh, I think it was Otto and. Uh, 
and Bob. Bob Genato. Okay, well there was one figment and a tag in there. Oh, look at this. I think we got everything that could be over there, though. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the smallest of screams. If I had been a total ninja, I could have, like, fucking time frozen that thing. Okay. Is the dive, like, like fucking Mario? Mario Odyssey dive? By the way, I don't even- I, all I've heard is that there is a dive move. But I have no idea what it is. Like, should I- is it a priority? Should I go get it before I do anything else? Because in the achievements it says whoever, like, Dion is. I don't even remember. He's got, like, ten siblings. Um, okay, I think that's I'm, that's all I'm feeling for this zone. Concessions. This one, I'm sure there's some signets lying around. Thanks for the ride. <sighs> oh, wow. Simple. Easy. Yes. Immediately that's locate something. Down. Ooh. That's a little bit of tiny crust there. I like the interactable, these things. It's like, whoa! Imagine you're blasted on acid and you find a little dandelion seed thing. I mean, you'd be blown away. Just, just as the seeds would be. I already see a trash figment. The bird. Uh, wait, wasn't there? Well, okay. Look at this. It's a, it's a thing. Oh, and look at that. There's Bob Zanato. Looking back, watching Lark's stream, there were definitely lots of hints that, uh, that the two had a relationship, but, uh, nothing super explicit. There's possibly even an anal sex joke. Uh, this is how Lark did this, by the way. He burned the memory vault and got it early. I, I think I've maybe fucked it up. Nope, I got it. Ford forgets. So there they are. Getting yeeted by Maligula. He, damn, we actually get to see him getting shoved to the bottom of the lake. That's fucked up. So, Lark kind of got spoiled with this, because he did this early. He shot- right, he, he told us, or he, he mentioned how he did this. He, like, squeezed his fucking brain out and shot it up to the surface. Is that- oh, that's Maligula, like, all locked up in a thing. Hmm. Damn. He literally just, like, should have done the brain thing before using the astrolathe on himself, and then it would have been fine. And then here's Otto coming along. <laughs> wow. Lame. Uh, I don't even suppose there's any reason to get Gur out to pull the switch there, actually. Even the fences have, like, shifting colors on them. How did I not notice that the first time? Whoa. Do you see this Nick abomination? Look at that. <laughs> Two nicks are like melded into one another. I'm sure there's plenty of examples of that going on in this audience here. Yeah, that was pretty fucking depressing to see though. Because I, I always kind of thought like Bob was all kind of nonchalant about the whole thing, even though he was clearly like torn up about it. There, no, he was just like bawling his fucking eyes out. That was depressing. I wonder if, uh, like, I haven't explored the overworld too much, but I'm sort of wondering if we'll get to see Helmut Fullbear back in his normal body, right? Nest egg. Oh, I filled my wallet. Nice, that's an achievement. Because uh, we saw Nick, his brain is back in his own body, so I can only assume 
they did get Helmut Bolt, Fulbear's body from the bottom of the lake and bring it back up. Because it was preserved. What if he's like a soggy corpse? Okay. Um... There's gotta be something I'm missing here. I don't know. Uh, th it doesn't tell you how many figments you have in a specific area, right? I think that would be cool if it did that. But I don't think it does that. Like, that would just help a lot. To know what you're looking for in each specific zone. Especially considering they went through all this work to cut all the zones up into little segments. For seemingly no reason. Okay. Uh... Uh, yeah, I didn't see the time- oh, here. I didn't see the time bubble list video, no. I still want to fuck around with that one badge. In fact, I think after this little segment, I'm gonna go back to the overworld. I'm gonna get that dive ability, and I'm gonna purchase the speed up badge, because I want to try that out for, like, speed running. Tech. I don't know if- I don't- people have probably already tried it and established if it works or not, I guess, but, uh... I'm curious to find out for myself, and this will be the perfect world to test it with. Okay, I think that was... I'm... I'm not sure. That might have been it. Just taking another peek around. Uh, okay. Now... Exit brain, because I have uh, a full wallet. Might as well just go spending spree. Let's get all the, uh... Let's fill up on popsicles, or whatever, uh, lollipops. I think I- I feel like I pretty comprehensively cleared out those- those areas. Wow, this is taking a while. <laughs> okay. Uh, now... <laughs> I'll have to try out that shit, uh... All sorts of uh, speedy shenanigans. But first priority... Is there... There's not an automatic in here, right? I think the Autobahn is there, but it's also really close. Okay. Now, let me go down here. Side cards piling up. And do I have the, uh, the badge on that makes it so that I... No, here. No, I don't want Beast Mastery. Get that out of here. Uh, okay. Which one of these extends the duration of your brain block upgrade? I don't even fucking know what that means. What is brain block? I'm genuinely at a loss. It's- I'm sure it's something. Let's make one of these. Beep, 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 boop, beep. Okay, uh... Now get me... All these... Uh... Can buy, like, a greater quantity? No. Uh, I've already got... Right, I haven't ever actually used a Dream Fluff. Is there, like, a maximum amount of these that I can buy? They're so cheap now. Uh, okay, I'm gonna just buy all of these. You get an achievement for that. <laughs> I'm, I feel like such a cold motherfucker. You ought to be in pictures! Funny, 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 funny. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, way, way ahead of you, chat. Uh... I can tell you are an intern, staff member, we just got that very achievement. Um, let's get the speed one. Speed reader, no. Uh, it's gotta be, they're like sorted by category. Projection. Time bubble. Squeezes more time out of your time bubbles. Inflates your time bubble to slow a much bigger area. Okay, this is the one I want. Wise choice. Wise. Twouldn't. Okay. 
sets you side blasts. Mm. Dropped items will be drawn to you from a greater distance. I feel like I've checked all these a million times. It's probably time to just start buying. Get the one that shuts up my little guy. Perfect. Digitize your archetype for a retro makeover. Okay, we gotta try these out. Pin this and watch your archetype move like the wind. We gotta, like, stack all of these. Explode into confetti upon death. Sure. Grabbing an enemy with mental connection will deplete their health. Sure. Use mental connections to anchor your enemies in place. Sure. Each mental connection node has a chance to restore a little mental energy. Hey, that's like an Isaac item. Uh, channels more psychic energy into your punches. Dank. Yeah, the main melee combo, I never actually used the, like, the ground pound ability in this game, by the way. Bedazzle your enemies while pummeling them with a, with full spectrum fists. Rain blow load. Dropped items will be drawn to you from a greater distance. Keeps you from getting encumbered by those gooey, yeah, the, uh, useless. Literally, like, some of these are just so useless. Because they, do you ever get more slots for badges? Maybe you do. Deal more damage, but also take more damage. I feel like I would have found it if there was a way. Oh, right Stop even reading these. The hmm. Bye, Kingpin. I got that achievement too, and we've still got some money left over. Jeez, um, H Christmas. Okay, time to like try out some of these pins. Whenever you need more gear, the automatic will be here. I always do that. Hell yeah, look at this. Full badge screen out of nowhere. When we had, like, almost none of them before. So, let me... Just get rid of all these ones. I don't really care. I mean, does it really matter getting money anymore? Gotta try the retro one. Gotta try this. Gotta try that. Actually, I, I mean, he's probably got custom dialogue for when he's got both of these. Let's just try them all at once. Just for shits and giggles. Be a rank riser, not card miser. Wow, that's adorable. He's a little Game Boy boy. Hey! <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> okay. Uh, can I. Can we, like. Hey, sweetheart. Looking good, man. Uh, it doesn't even truly shut him up, it just muffles him. I wonder if his mouth is gone because of the badge. Like, I wonder if they really. Let's see. Go, uh... Go do something. Oh no, he's got the same voice. I thought he would have, like, a chip toony voice, maybe. No, there's not really, like... There's not, like, complicated interactions of, like, stacking. Okay. Uh... ba ba bum bum So, that's funny. Cyclone. Oh god, I suck at using this. Ah, wow! Suck at using the menu. It's A to unequip. It's just a little weird. Bit weird. Uh, so I don't care about the shop one anymore. I don't care about actually using any of those, but the 8-bit the one is cute. Uh, and that's a good detail. Those are fun. Speeds up objects and enemies. That's the one that I want. Squeeze some more time out of your time bubbles too. Sure. Oh, let's try this one out, too. And then that that TK one could be really cool. Thrown objects will daze your enemies for much longer. Yeah, I don't know if you can mix the ball colors. Uh, I never really used... Like, I never really used telekinesis that much in combat, and maybe I should have. Sorry, this is probably super exciting to people watching at home who are like, I just want to see the funny brains. Give the chain brain side blast upgrade. Some of these are so specific too. It's like on specific enemies. It's like who cares? Fire attacks and hazards won't drain as much. It already doesn't really matter. And then this this is actually kind of cool. I kind of want this instead of big time. Well, I guess I'll, I'll replace it with the rainbow punches. Honestly, right? Brain block is part of clairvoyance. Okay. Uh, show me my punches. Oh, that's cool. Hell yeah! <laughs> I like that the characters comment on your archetype, too. I kinda like the rainbow fists. Shit's good, mate. 
Now get my archetype out of here. Bye. Bitch. This guy wants to make me a fucking deal. Wow, look. They, they blink like Pixar characters. Actually, his eye is misaligned. Look. His eye is poking out of his face. <laughs> this fat ass lady fucking floats down. His eye is poking through. That's a glitch. That guy's eye is fucked up. In fact, does he have, like, two eyes where one should be? Is that what's going on? Oh no, now it's fixed. Okay. It got, like, displaced when he moved. Look, now it's fucked up again. What the hell? It's out of place, his eye! Okay, that's cursed. That's some Fallout New Vegas shit. Uh, anyway. Should I keep this rainbow punch thing? It does look good. Oh, I just accidentally hit that guy. He's already so sick of the- Wow! He's already so sick of the interns doing this shit. The rainbow load is cool, but I want something useful. I think that's kind of the, the ultimate downside of the, uh... The cosmetic pins. Like, I heard someone say cosmetic pins shouldn't take up any slots, and yeah. Ain't that the fucking truth? There should be a separate there should be a separate set of slots just for cos cosmetic ones, and you should be able to mix and match as much as you want. But whatever. Hmm. I had the exact thing with the dog's eyeballs in Fallout New Vegas. It's in my Fallout New Vegas video. I've seen- I love the discourse on if, uh, it is even possible to do a, uh, a truly glitchless run of Fallout New Vegas. Like, even casual runs, because glitches are just so permeated into the fucking game. Okay, let's just do this. Get me out of this menu. <sighs> Menuing is so boring to me a lot of the time. Uh, alright, we've got- is there anywhere else to, like, spend money? Also, let me look at this. Look, they're arm in arm. And he's holding a mushroom. This is great, you can understand so much more of this now. Casio. There's that big ass eye, that's re reminiscent of uh, Helmut Fulbear's world, too. Forward in the middle. He's clean shaven. He, he looks a lot less fucking insane. And there's Compton with his animals. There's, uh, it, actually, excuse me, is that Otto? with Citanium, and his fucking weird, funky experiments. And then, wow, uh, she's right there, wait. She's right there. That's whack. I didn't even realize she was in this mural until this very second. Okay, there's Biggie Cheese. Uh, yeah, I, uh, you can read the individual ones, too. I think we did that before. Oh, he has, I see. Only one of the Psychic Seven whose mind I didn't get Yeah. Maybe He's got custom way. dialogue now that we beat the game. Oh, and what's up with these guys? It, what's with the fucking bacon guy? He was something about- there's something to do with Ford, but I, like, forget what was happening. Oh, they're in love. <laughs> Filthy-ass kid. Uh, cool. Cool. Why? <laughs> the little cigarette machine? The fuck? Some of these I don't exactly get. It's like, go, f go fetch me cigarettes. Like, what is- what? Okay. And I, I don't think I can, uh, I don't think I can talk- I can interact with that one. Uh, I kinda- I don't exactly care, but... I guess they're short. I'm so happy Helmet's alive. I hope they find his body someday. Hmm. I hope Cassie keeps the legend of the Green Needle Witch alive. They need something to scare the new mm. interns. So that line about I hope they find his body, that could just be some shit where like I actually, it's just, oh, I haven't seen his body. So they programmed that line to play at that time, but I kind of doubt it. So I kind of feel like we're not going to see Helmet back in his oh, body, but maybe we will. I'm not sure if you messed up my family. Or if you saved it. I mean, I might not even exist if you hadn't done what you did. 
Maybe I'll figure it out. Later. I wonder if these all changed like as you completed stuff in the game. It's probably really what how it works. Dogen. Or at least help out the squirrels back in camp. Okay. Now. Hey, you there. I don't need to worry about Citanium. We're not making money from mental connections anymore, I think. Uh, now... I was gonna go do the Dion thing. I don't even remember. Is Dion the one that had the... that was, like, flirting with one of my, uh, intern friends? Hold on. Let me just go to the Autobahn. Much faster. I ate these fucking cookies. You can get these cookies at Safeway. These like they're like the Safeway brand. Like they make them every day or whatever. And they're like these fat fucking cookies. They're dense. They got big chunks of chocolate in them. But they, I swear they like inject acid into these. Like not drug acid, but like horrible. Like my stomach fucking burns when I eat them. It, I don't know what it is. And I know some people are like, Grapefruit, I, I've seen you. You don't need those big cookies. And I, I know. But I eat them anyway. <laughs> and then they burn me. Okay, um, so. Let me go check out. Uh, is this. Who are you? What else did you learn? Dion. Did you know Am I really locked out from getting the fucking dive box? move then? Because I didn't talk to this guy at a certain point? Is that legit? I'm gonna go, like, talk to all the, like, main family members. That's insane. If that's the case. So I can just miss out on having a move? It was like, help him set up the tent. Is the achievement. That shit. Uh, sucks if that's the case. Where's, uh, campgrounds? I mean, it might be the campgrounds. Who I never met. Not Don't forget the part where I beat the hand of Galokio. You mean hand where Galokio. we beat the hand of Galokio? Don't forget the part where I beat the hand of Galokio. You mean where um, we beat the hand of Galokio? Get to the top of the tent? Which tent even is it? There's a few. Uh, I think I already talked to all these characters. Hi, Mom. Putty, my middle baby. So glad you are here. Much work to do. I'm gonna get back to my important spy stuff. Don't forget to check on your father, Mr. Big Man of the World. Circus tent outside the pancake shop. Okay. Uh, fuck. This area is a little tricky to navigate. I think it's this way? Let's take a little peek. No. Absolutely not. Wrong. Incorrect. This way. Uh. I'll find it eventually. Yep. Oh, wow. That's... Okay. Over here. Here we go. Uh-huh. Did I, is it just... I don't really know what I'm looking for, frankly. I, I don't see a big-ass tent. Like, up there? There is a thing up there. There's also... whatever that is. Oh, well, these... these are what I'm... okay. Let me just see whatever the fuck that is. Oh, maybe shoot it. Nice. Oh. Oh! Family is in tents. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that's, uh, hmm. Maybe, maybe fix that. Okay. Because that, so that I would never have thought to do that, time. to investigate that. But I still don't have to like it. Do if you? I had not been prodded in welcome. this direction. Seeing the old Aquato Dome again reminds that me was of the, the that, that was kind of bad that you can that that can happen. Oh, it reminds me of an old trick he taught me once. Wow. Press B while in the air to dive into a tumble. Okay. 
All right, it's kind of like Mario. Let me go from higher up. Uh, let me see if I can... Oh, look, there's a thing up there. Can I climb on these ropes? Bet I can step on them. Hold on. I can step on the clotheslines in the other world now. Sad. Let me just platform up it then. Uh, can I go in it? Hold on. Ah, the Aquato Dome. Huh. It's not big. Oh damn! And again, wow. Neither were our audiences. This is great. I didn't. Wow. I'm just happy that it's not made of meat. <laughs> and we got the music. Okay. This mechanic, I feel like, was the one thing that was still stanky about the platforming. Honestly, is these like stationary rungs. It just, it's, it's weird to me. And it was weird in the first game, too. Yeah, boy. Nice. This is fun. I assume there'll be a, or maybe there'll just be a door to the outside up here. Boing. Nice. Simply fun. Uh, okay. And then this. I, I never established what these do. Are the chat, are these switches? Or do these just safely transport me down? Because these feel like switches. But I think, I think that might just be a safe way of descent. But you can also just like, you know, hold on to your double jump before you touch the ground like a big boy. Just way down. All right. It's just, uh... I know the old ground pound trick from Mario 64. Actually, does that even work in Mario 64? Ground pounding before you hit the ground? This is the dumbest. Why am I doing this? I refuse to get up there the normal way. Nice. Uh, I gotta use this, try out this dive some point. I'm glad those aren't switches. Maybe try this. Maybe this might be the perfect spot. Uh, oh, there's another one up there. Look, I'm going to play it safe, actually. I want to get it. Or wait. Oh, I was going to, I was going to say, I'm going to hit the thing, the bump thing. I know this is the dumbest shit, but I'm going to go back and I'm going to try doing the dive thing to see if it would have worked because now the stakes are lowered because I got that thing. Mario Sunshine had the best ropes that you walk on, that you bounce, you know? That was, that was the best one. Anyone else think that, like, walking on rope physics peaked at Mario Sunshine, and it has all been downhill from here? Okay, alright. It's not like a... It's not like the cat dive. I kind of thought it was like the cat dive. But no, it really is just if you need a tiny bit more extra. So it's it's cool, but it's not like a necessary move to have, I think. But I'm glad I got it. And I'm glad you can at least still get it. But uh, how you would ever know to do that if you missed talking to him in front of the tent the one time, I just simply do not know. Uh, am I expected to platform on the giant ape statue. I think that's what we're doing. Wow. Let's see if I can do this. Neat. Oh, it's a Gravity Falls reference, dude! Bruh. Sad. I was really hoping I could grab that ledge. Uh, okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. He's got a thing on his back. I didn't see the thing. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow, that didn't even really help me in my current situation that much. Okay. Uh, alright. I need to find a way to get up there. I don't really... I don't really see a, a way to... I guess just go from up here? Hold on. If this doesn't work, I'm sure there's something else. Oh wait, how did I even, uh... 
Right, that's a whole thing getting up there. Wait, the car is bouncy? Ex fucking excuse me? That's stupid, if that's the case. Not this car, I guess. Either that is just a lie. I think I've just been like lied to. Oh guys, it wasn't wrong, it was debated. This is weird though, it definitely feels like it wants you to go from that like sign. The hood. That is dumb. That is really, really bad. Holy shit. Oh, oh. Like, literally what? Literally what? <laughs> like, huh? That, that is stanky. That is incredibly stanky. I'm glad the guy was up here. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Wow. That was incredible stuff. Do I, like, swing my arms? Look at this dude. Oh, shit. Oh, what? It's a rail that you ride. God damn it. That was jank. Can you, like, swing on the thing on his back? I'm kinda scared to try. Okay, well... It's fine, I can just bounce on the hood of the car. Folks. Surely there's a way I can just get up here. God damn it. I think there is, but I'm just gonna... Okay, do you swing on this? No. Cool if the, if the switch could double function as it swing, but no. What is? What do they really want me to do here? Like run along his back? With the amount they kind of like slap your wrist when you try to go out of bounds in this game, it's always weird when they have you actually do like weird sort of just climb all over the architecture shit like that. Okay, and now this is a rail that you grind. What the fuck? <laughs> all right. Okay. Yeah, I'm being informed that there was there was a collectible previously on the hood of that car. Which normally, yeah, directing the directing your attention like that works. Uh maybe I might have even noticed that it was bouncy but just not thought about it. Cuz my goal was not to get on top of that thing at the time. I don't know, but it's also possible to just get it and just move on. Okay, now I'm finding it difficult to do that, but yeah. I don't know. I have no idea if if we did. I, of course, didn't remember. Are you lost? <laughs> but, uh, clearly it is missable. By human who play game. Alright, uh, do I want to fuck around with the, the creepy quest here? This'll be a... This'll happen another time. I want to go back into... Acid Brain. Yeah. Yep. Shit, I was right next to the Autobahn and then I moved. This area is a little... A little confusing to get around, which, yeah, I know. Question marks. Still. Okay. Directly into the brainular machine. Hmm. Is it time to take a spin in the brain tumbler? Why is this? Yes. Dialogue. Go to the okay. I'm ready to go. This is a pretty quick to load area. All right. Now, 
You're no longer making money with the mental connections, unfortunately. So, so sad. It's fine though, because I think we literally have no use for money anymore. Uh, maybe we do. I mean, I guess there's like Psy Pops and shit. Okay. Now I've got a lighter wallet. And a, uh... A new move that I will probably barely use, <laughs> or if not, never, never use. Uh, uh, I ate too many acid cookies. I need to get somewhere quick. Woods. I already did that one. I already did concessions. Eye shrine. That always makes me a little dizzy. Okay. What do we got this? What, what, what do we got here? What do we got this here, there? Those are the same, like, models with the speakers on them. Reused. Everything's all bendy. Also, it spawned me, like, kind of in the middle of the area. What's up with that? Oh, I got the speed thing. Hold on. Yeah, boy! Fuck me right up. Alright, that was silly of me. I should probably take that badge off to actually do part of the area. That's weird. It sticks around for a while, but then it stops actually speeding it up. Uh, okay, I really want to do it on the spinny platforms, though. So, this is going to be kind of annoying. Uh, wait, shockwave. Did that just, like, automatically go? I didn't press a button there. It just got added. Okay, that was weird. Maybe I bought that before or something. Paper cuts, and I want this one. Nice. We're so close. We're so close to being able to get this one, and then... We won't have to worry about all that shit until rank 102, bitch. Okay. Oh, right. I need to actually, uh... Swap this out. Time warp. Uh, oh no. Welcome to hell, Raz. Raz Sputin. Put that on. Fuck it. And now... Oh, sweet Lordy J. Ow. <clears throat> Little acid sensors. Cower before my levestation ability. Why did it- it like put me halfway through this zone. I don't know what's up with that. Why didn't the levitation guy put- or the uh, teleportation guy just put me right here? Weird. This is the song that dun 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 Did I just jump up from way down there? Now. 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 Okay. Well. Looks pretty empty so far. It was- it was pointless going back there. Maybe that's why they spawned me halfway through, because there was nothing of interest beforehand. Speeding up those fish. Must be kind of silly. I just don't quite care enough. Look at that, you can make shit float when you use time bubble on it. I don't know why, but like... And not just float, but just fall over. Like, we saw that a little bit in, uh, Fatherland Follies. <clears throat> okay. That effect is really cool, though. Uh, God, it feels like you could do some broken shit here. Dear Prudence. I heard someone say this was like, oh, it's like Lucy in the Sky with diamonds! I was like, bro, what? I'm not saying you have to agree with me that it sounds like Dear Prudence, but Lucy in the Sky? I don't know about that one, bro. Fuck. Okay. Oh, there's a figment. Spotted. Couple figments here. Is that all of them? I think it is. 
but you can slow those fish down too. Oh, nope. Never mind. He don't give a fuck. He don't give two shits. Uh, can I stand on those eyes? That would be awfully painful, rude, even. Hmm. I think you slip. Hold on. Let's, let's for once in my goddamn life use that ability. I feel like I should have been using that the entire video game, and I, I just sort of forgot that it existed. No. Now. That sucks. Uh, okay. God, it's gonna be so hard. I keep thinking things are figments, but no, that's just- it was just a figment of my imagination. Oh, there's half a mind. Only noticed when I was right goddamn next to it, and I still fell. <laughs> ah! That was that increased duration of time bubble. <laughs> I love how they just slap together. Unceremoniously. Also, it's a nice touch that there's no recharge time when you time bubble a uh, stage hazard. You know? I kind of want to... I guess uh, if I replay part of the game... I don't know if we'll get to this part, but part of me, I, I kind of want to rewatch that music video. I already did rewatch the music video, actually. Off stream. But just uh, now with all we know. Because there's, there's definitely a couple, like, big-ass hints that, uh, that Bob Zanato and, uh, Helmut Fulbear were homosexuals, as you could, as you could potentially say, if you were a criminal such as myself. Let's see if I can cheese this one, too. This is how Andrew did it. Nice. back over here, bitch. Can't shoot it. Can't go above it. I'm gonna have to whip out my dude. I'm sure I could lure him over here somehow, but uh, I don't really care that much. Excuse me. Nice. Oh, hell yeah. Safe cracker. I got all the memory vaults. That's one off the list. Helmut's Hail Mary. Fep. Bro, Fep. Broadway, probably. Theater. He's singing. All sorts of figments are coming out of him. There's all the figments I need. And for it's like, well done. You've sung to a fucking empty room. You're insane. You will work perfectly with our team. And Bob Zanato's like, oh, whoa, what's this? <laughs> nice. This is him performing at his little stage. This is Helmut's theater. I love seeing them all hang out. Now that I, uh, now that I know all of them. Oh, nice. Oh, this is how, this is what Lark got spoiled on. I didn't even see this. He in particular. Because this is stuff you're supposed to only be able to get with the archetype. Which is after the, you know, halfway point of the game. But now, uh, but with pyrokinesis you can cheese it. So he, that, that's how he really got spoiled. I, I thought he had kind of a nonchalant reaction to seeing that they were, like, married. Oh, shit. I feel like I've already, like, possibly missed things. Whatever. Let's just take a good peek. Okay, this is what I was looking for. Put on the time thing. Put on the other time thing. <sighs> Speed it up, baby! Whee! Yeah! You can actually fling yourself with it! Yes! Oh my god, this is a dream. It's a fidget spinner! Yeah! Oh my god, it's a slick strat! <laughs> everything I ever hoped. That's amazing. Oh, shit. It, and it normally just hurts you. But here it distinctly flings you. Oh my god. 
That is so good! That's so good! Someone clip it! It's a strat! Oh my god. Any level that has those, you can do that. I knew that badge was gonna be, like, I, how did I know? I knew it was gonna be jank. Fling yourself. Momentum. And I got a figment out of it. Of course, I am completely off track now, but I, don't, I could not care less. Found a strat, baby. <laughs> oh shit, I keep thinking I see figments in the distance. I'm still on the figment hunt. But I'm just really off track now. I don't think we don't know how to weed them out. I'm gonna try it with these two. This is just gonna like... Oh, fuck. Okay. I don't think... I, did we try it with the fans, actually? I think we did. Okay, it's going. Ah, uh, sad. I think it might only be the little spinny platforms. Yeah. Well, we'll, we'll keep trying it on shit. Yeah, those, that doesn't fling me. That's so fucking funny. Because, okay, and here's the weirdest thing. I thought that those little spinning platforms didn't have any sort of contact damage. But they do, but for some reason, using the time the speed bubble actually gets rid of the hitbox. And just makes it so they fling you, which is insane. Okay, I... Helix Snake was saying that the entire level can be done without time slow ability, by the way. But, uh, I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be using the normal time slow to actually get through the level, you know? That's so exciting, though, that there's there's actually a strat you can do with that. <laughs> Neat. Oh, this is another... Er, actually, no, I think we already got all the memory vaults, right? This was something I already got. This was a burn, baby burn. Yeah, give me the money. The strat, the strat, the strat. Okay, get me out of here, dear prudence. Oh. It does really sound like the Shire theme, but I, I don't think that's an intentional Lord of the Rings reference. Fuck. Slow it down. <laughs> then put- I, I think if I took the badge off, it would still- We can- we can try it. But I think the badge would- like, it would still just be sped up. I don't think it would- Or it would still be normal slowed. Someone's saying, have the badge off, slow it. Then get on... And take the bat change the badges out so it goes speedy. I- I don't think it's- I don't think that would work, but uh, we can try it. The senses. The sanses. Okay. Slow it down. Uh, shit. <laughs> this is gonna fling me into the water if it flings me anywhere. Uh, put this on. Yeah, no. I kinda figured it wouldn't, like, change it. Like, the. It wouldn't change it mid instance. Okay, perfect, though. Let's get up here. Worth trying. Gotta remember I have the speed thing on now. Those red vines in the distance, I always think those are figments, because they just stick out like a sore thumb. Oh look, there's a thing. Look, look. I think I hear Your boy has found a thing. Nice. Oh, and there was actually a little path to that, okay. Don't I feel like a silly billy? Oh, this is so exciting, because there are there are a lot of levels that have something similar to those little spinning things, you know? And I think there's probably other hazards that we can do a similar jank with. Uh, did I hear the, like, teleportation guy there? Oh no, that was the health things refilling, I get it. Uh, okay, so I think we're basically set for back there. Fuck, we might not be. Let's just cross this rainbow bridge and go up there. 
Because I think if there's going to be any figments left, they're most likely going to be near the end. Because that's when we had the like little cutscene that warps us away. There's a figment. Spotted. Is this the end? Or have we been around back to the beginning? <laughs> is it, uh, like... I just noticed Vision is now talking to me rather than, uh, Psy King. Is this new dialogue, even? I think it is. Possibly. Uh... <laughs> Am I supposed to be doing this? Fuck. Oh. Uh, this would be a good vantage point, if nothing else. <laughs> okay. Ah. Um. Now, because in uh, Grulovia world, there was there was a little bit of custom dialogue just for. Oh, look at that little sneaky Bob. Uh, there was custom dialogue because uh, certain characters were missing. Lily. Specifically. So I assume going up here won't actually, like, do anything, yeah. Well, that sneaky Bob figment, that would have been annoying to miss on this second go around. I feel like I did not check this area insanely thoroughly. But I don't see any figments up there. Uh, I, I want to go fuck around with those platforms more. I'm feeling good. Uh, missed one down there. I don't suppose, are you, is that referring to the music note one that I got? Or did I really miss, oh wait. I don't know. I have no idea. I wanna go mess with those things. Uh, I wonder if I could even get there from here. Fucked it up. Fucked it up. Okay. Um. Let me just take a peek over here. Here we go. Is that the one you're talking about? Hopefully. I hope so. <laughs> See, if not, that means there's even more. Okay. Um, you got it. Cool. I will... Oh, uh, shit. Why am I trying to do this again? These are microphones. I didn't even realize these are like a little microphone stand. Ha! Oh. Okay, we're fine. Okay. Uh, I think that's just about everything. Now I just want to fuck around with those a little more. I mean, the most it'll do probably is just fling me to a different part of the level. But, uh... The idea... The idea is to get out of bounds. Like, truly out of bounds. Not just to a platforming thing that you're probably not supposed to go to. But, like, out of goddamn bounds, you know? Is that... I'm still on speed mode. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right, I don't need to... Uh, I keep thinking I need to go in there to equip it. Let's go over here. Well, I, I never actually opened that gate. Wow, that sucked. Okay. 
Okay. Back to these. There's probably another area where these are more, like, readily accessible, too. I'm gonna actually go to the second one here. So that if I... If I go anywhere... Hopefully I won't touch ground and it'll respawn me on this platform. Now, go back up. Okay. Here goes nothing. Oh, big fish. Whoa! Whoa! Did you see my double jump bubble? Go, like, off screen? Wow, they go so fast. Whee! <laughs> I got true combo. I got true combo. That is so satisfying to do. They spin so fast. I want to go that way. Hold on. I want to go over there. So, like, hit this part of it. Nope. Okay. Whoa. Ding, ding, ding. I'm, like, ricocheting all over the place. <laughs> Look at my, my double jump bubble. is like, glitching out with the momentum. <laughs> this is just fun. Eventually I'll get sick of it. Maybe. It's like, if I could just get to anywhere, like, truly out of bounds, it would be so good. But I don't know. Like I've said before, they're pretty liberal with the invisible walls in this game. Maybe try doing it on the levitation bubble. Hold on. Nope. Levitation ball makes you completely fine. Actually, hold on. Let's, let's do this. Yeah. Whoa! Hold on. I went like whoosh there. Yo! <laughs> That's so powerful. That's amazing. <laughs> Please clip that shit. That's incredible. Wow, you get whipped around. And it's so great that falling isn't like a hazard anymore. Wow, uh, the screen like flashed with something horrible there. Actually, wait. Sometimes it hurts. It's only when I go in the water that it doesn't hurt. Oh. <laughs> Sadly, its launching potential is not as good as, uh... Not as good as when you're not on the ball. Oh, look at that. Actually, was that- did I just accidentally stumble upon the thing Helix Snake was trying to say? Like, Psy Blast can help? Maybe not. Probably not. Oh, oh, oh! I'm going. Okay. Shit. I messed up completely. Shit. Ooh. It's like, imagine if you could get some, like, you know that classic glitchy shit where you go so fast that one frame you're on one side of a wall and the other you're on the other? That's the dream. That is the real dream of what would, would happen here, but I'm starting to doubt it. As fun as it is to zoop around. Is that a figment over there? <laughs> I like how you go like sometimes. Like it sort of revs you up before you go. Sad. <laughs> I love when you just fall through the earth. Shit. I just accidentally did the like ball dive. That is so fucking powerful. I love that. Let's let it run out. It'll probably just hurt me. Yep. Sad. Lame. Lame. <laughs> okay, a, a couple more and then I'm done. Just two more games. Just one more life. Whee! I love how you, like, ricochet off of it. 
It seems hard to get a consistent direction. Real tricky. Bruh. Bruh, it's not a solid surface. This sucks. Okay. <laughs> I was able to double or I was able to double jump there, so I was technically on the ground sometimes. What if you like combo between the two of them? Yeah! <laughs> Oh, I love how it revs you up. That could, like, imagine just becoming a god at that in speedruns, you know? That would be so good. Okay, I think I am done... ...schmeshing around with that. In this particular room. Fuck. Okay. Diving into it? I don't know. We'll, we'll try that next time we see some of those platforms. Uh, so where the hell is the teleport guy? Oh, fuck. It's gonna be so hard. He fits right in. This is- is this where he's from? People were saying his name is Oatmeal in, like, a design doc or something like that. The little teleport guy. But this is his world. This is where he's from. I don't like that brand. A guy named Mike took my lunch money. That's why I did that. Here he is. Could you give me a lift? Ear Hand Shrine. This was one of the coolest worlds. This is the one that's like split down the middle. Got a little bubble juice in my nose that time. <laughs> yeah, I don't think the rank required to use the speed thing is is that crazy, right? I don't know. Actually, I. I've only been limited by rank requirements once, but this is a casual playthrough. Oh, look at that. Figment right there. Um... Sad. So sad. Oh, look at that! Is this- oh, this is like where a connection used to be, I think, or something. No? No, I don't think it is. Oh, look, Bloodborne eyes. <laughs> this is the grabby world. Okay. The, uh, the, like, oh god, right. The sense counterpart that feels least like their real world counterpart is probably, uh, Audio, Bob Zanotto, and I, I, maybe that's just because of the Casio thing. I, I know I can just equip the other thing. Oh fuck, let me wall jump off that. You bastard. Whatever. Um... Hmm. Fuck. I'm well aware that they don't pick shit up in, uh, in speedruns, by the way, but, uh... Or, or they tend not to. But sometimes, a strat is so good or so useful... ...that it makes it worth it, right? I'm not saying that's necessarily the case with this at all, but, uh... It's not unheard of at all, right? Nice. fish with an ear. That was just some weird fucking creepy shit. What do we got over here? Is this one that I never actually activated? Or no, I just have to do it again. Is there, is there any sort of like easter egg where you point this at anything else? Because as cool as this is, you kind of just do like one thing with it and it's not even really like solving a puzzle. Let's just find the glowing rainbow thing. We're just fighting these guys again. No. Sad. I really wish a lot of those combat arenas would, like, fill back up. You know? This is cool. 
sad. So many invisible walls, though. God. And look, I bet that's the same body as Ford. I bet they just reused it. Right? Am I crazy? Maybe not. But I guess, like, the ear thing is, like, supposed to slightly resemble his beard. I don't know if that's actually true. Okay, well, I got a couple things. I don't suppose... No. Uh, give me some help. Well, as long as I'm just chilling here in free health zone, might as well heal up. Still need to use a dream fluff, I guess. But oh well, my self-preservation instinct is just too, too good! I don't know what I'm doing. I think this is... I think this area has been mostly probed. This is a small... I guess this is like the area where you find... This is the area where you go after you find them, not the area that you find them in. Because the, there's lots of sub-areas in this world. But I think, like, this is legit just it. I think, yeah, that, that trophy must have been where a connection used to be. Hey, I need to get somewhere quick. Um, okay. So, I've done... I think Nose Mouth Shrine is the last one. Oh, God. The knowledge that we are already at the last one is unsettling Let's because try. I feel like the collectibles that I have here. Oh, look at that. I got a... Is that gold stamp always been there? It looked like it just appeared. Is that because I got rank 90 or some shit? Certified Psychonauts? Okay. Uh, let's just take a peek here. Still a few figments. Oh, God. Well, we'll see. We'll see where we're at after this world. And then I might have to do some classic, like Psychonauts 1, there were a couple figments, I just had to look up where they were. Which is not as hard as you would think it is, because they do give you that list of figments in this game. No, this is the cool one that's split in two. And look, it's uh, Compton and uh, Cassiopeia. They were friends. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll check out that video uh, probably before next stream, I think, of this, and then we can fuck around with the tricks. Uh, let me try to speed up on these. I kind of doubt it'll do anything, honestly, but uh, might as well give it a little attempt here. Uh, hold on. Or th no, this is a slidey thing, right? I right, remembered the instant I jumped. <laughs> oh my god. What that tongue do? <laughs> okay, give me the fucking right thing. Monka S. Monka S. Okay. Um. God. Oh, look at that. Spotted. Nugget of wisdom atop the tongue. That's. Oh, shit. I got licked. Hardcore. What, what happens if you let the tongue just slowly crush you? Fuck. Oh, shit. Eh. Keep slowing it down like a crazy man. I'm insane. I'm practically insane. Grab it. Nice. That's a cool one. I'm gonna let the tongue slowly crush me. Oh, fuck. That's not even a real slap on the ground. Watch it. Oh! <laughs> oh! That was crusty. All right, well, that's what happens. Okay. Uh, this, when the music really gets going, it really do get going, though. 
and and I love it. Oh fuck! Slap, 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 slap. Slap, slap, clap, clap. Bulby. Slap, 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 clap, clap, clap. This bridge in particular. A great moment. What a wonderful world. Those little mini sensors. It's like, why even fucking bother me with them? Honestly. Man, remember the first game when it was all those little, like, I think they were called personal demons and, uh, sensors just everywhere? And, and that was it for enemies, basically? Rough times. Uh, okay. I don't think I've seen... any extra, like, shit that I missed. I should have just taken the, uh... Let me just take this back. Whee! Okay, uh... There's less, like, spinning platforms in this world, by the way. I think those two that we saw were the only two so far. Uh, so, oh god. This world is, is just a nightmare to 100%. I feel like I haven't even properly probed that side. Uh, is there anything atop those, perhaps? Mustache. It's not fine, too. He's angry. I'm angry. <laughs> oh shit, I can do these. <laughs> Gimme. Nice. Yeah, that's one figment. You're welcome. Wow, that is literally one figment. What the fuck? How dumb is that? The, the hell? I'm hiccuping like crazy, ugh. Oy vey. Get me off of this schnoz. Is that really all that those were gonna- that they there to do? There aren't, like, figments between the spokes here, but there are in that other world. Oh, man. <sighs> There's a lot of, like, alternate paths, too. Fuck. Huh, huh. Oh wait, is that... Do I see something over there? At least I got the nugget, but like, there's two entire luggages that I did not get so far. Shit. No, don't... Okay. I was gonna say, don't just stay down there. Okay. Ah, uh, ha ha ha. At least I don't have to do these, uh, gumball puzzles anymore. Guys, gumballs. All it is, just a little bit of gum. What, what's a little gum between friends? <sighs> I feel like I've missed so many already, honestly. Bum, 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 bum. This is the big stage, too. Like, this is it. Was there... A, was there another area for me to, like, explore? Good god. I think this might be one I have to come back to. Like, I might just have to boringly Google some shit. Off stream, you know? I keep thinking, oh, there's a figment. Nope. Uh, 
Okay, well, get me back to the teleport guy, I guess. Let's go down all of the yellow brick road here. Okay. Could you give me a lift? Uh, was there baggage? I don't know. If there was, I would I would have gone up to it, or if I had seen it, rather. Let me check back here. Because people are saying that this is a thing. Oh, oh, I see some. Oh, and look, there's the half a mind. Oh my god. Go around. Oh, look at this. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh, what, what the fuck? What? This is a whole thing. Oh my god. Wait, this is so spoilery. Wow, okay. <laughs> Wow. I bet there's something behind there, too. <laughs> Compton's, like, fancy attire. Wow. I wonder if this is... Can you, like, see this when you first go through this level? Jesus. Let me... The only way to get rid of that is to burn it, apparently. Oh, this is just the half of mind, I think. Nice. Um. Nothing else here? Saw some more figments up there, of course. Uh. Alright, wow. Damn, well, that that is a pretty fucking significant hint. That is by far the most significant. All the other ones, it's like, okay, you just sort of, like, see them interacting a lot, and, you know, they share a glass of wine in one of the cutscenes, or in one of the memory vaults and such. Wow, that is, uh, sneaky. Okay, we're missing one, uh... Hmm. Let me just take a peek around. I feel like it might be here, or it might just be in, in the, in the great beyond bum, 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 bum. Uh, you guys seeing any here uh, secret tunnel That's so crazy that there were so many figments here. Uh... I'm not seeing anything, personally. Hmm. Well, at least we can, we can, if it's just a single one, we can narrow it down pretty far. But I don't see, uh... Where is it? Someone actually said, by the big flower, as though that's not like a comedy joke. Oh, here we go. Behind. Look at that. That is a very sneaky figment. That is insanely sneaky. I'm really glad we didn't have to end up looking anything up. Uh, okay, and I think is that there isn't there one the the one piece of baggage in the other place uh, Yeah, that's the only thing left I think So uh, confirmed was it uh, this this last one the purse was in the the last world that I visited Someone said it was there, but I, they said it was they under the stage, which is making me think they were talking about this one, that the one in that world that I just got. But someone said it was here? Uh, 
that always makes me a little dizzy. I don't know about this. Uh... Okay, yeah, they were talking about the other thing. So, not in here, probably. Someone said that it's in concessions. Honestly, if I was not streaming, this is the this is the time when I would just Google where to find, like, where is purse, you know? Uh, and in fact, I, we, I mean, we don't even have confirmation that it's here. This is just going off one random person's word. I may still Google it. Memory Vault Gay Baby Jail. Brilliant. You see what I mean about that, like, swing? All I did there was press A while I was swinging forward and he just, like, let go. Oh, there it is. Spotted. <laughs> wow. I sorted all the emotional baggage in moment's mind. Wonder if I can be in the band. Nope. You'll never be in the band. You'll never be a cool enough dude, Raz. Okay. I'm just gonna do this. I seriously think this will take less time. Actually, does it just boot me? Oh god, it boots me all the way back here. At least Sasha's lab, they don't like load everything. Is it time to take a Boot me to the, the collective tumble? unconscious instead. Yes, I'm ready to go to the collective un Sometimes you have to hold down B. Sometimes you just have to press B to skip a cutscene. It's inconsistent. Uh, so, alright, I'm thinking maybe like one more world. I don't know, man. Cassie's collection. Okay, so this room, you remember? Oh, look! It's all her uh, personas here. Getting along with herself. Nice. There's even the librarian one. That's awesome. What are they doing? So, what's the plan? We were just trying to figure out who has to clean up the library. The general consensus mm. is it can wait until tomorrow. Brilliant. Well, I'll help you clean up some. He means loot. Huh? <laughs> 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 You're I'll the money, you Cassie. Too. Forever. <laughs> You're always thinking about money, money, Cassie. Let's see, uh... I, I don't suppose they all see me as different things under clairvoyance. Oh, that is time bubble. Oh! I've killed her! I'm sorry, madame. Bebby. Yeah, I think they all probably see me as Bebby. Oh no, she sees me as her little assistant. Who is the real one? My god. Bookworm. Beppy. Oh, look at that. I'm asking for her autograph. Oh, that's cute. Custom one for the author. Then what about the teacher? Am I a student? Nope, I am Beppy. Good. Okay. So this part, you guys remember when I got up on that orb and I tried to send my persona down there, or my uh, my archetype, to pull that switch, and it just didn't work? Well, that's the way to do it. <laughs> that's the way to do it. Lark did it on his stream and it worked just fine, so I don't know what I was doing wrong. But time to find out, I guess. Uh... I suppose I could fling myself with these. Oh god, why did I do that at that particular moment?
I bet I can fling myself with those, honestly. Come on. No. Fuck you. Grab the ledge there. Ledge was clearly there. It was obviously grabbable. There's another way to get up here, too. Hold on. Let me go this way. Yeah, this world isn't fucking empty. Fucking Compton Bull's world was just completely empty. That shit sucked ass. But here, like, the NPCs are still hanging. Okay. Archetype. Do your job. Go. Get the thing. Like, I tried a bunch of times off st er, on stream. Go down there. There he goes. I don't know why that didn't work when I tried it before. But finally. What's that sound? What's that smell? I don't know. Why, why did it? It was a terrible joke. Oh, somebody pooped! Shrek, dude! Oh, shit. That. Okay, it goes back down, though. It's on a timer. Fuck. I meant to do that. Okay, now he's working just fine. Okay. Uh, do it. Compton stays in psycho isolation? Nah, uh, Nick is in there now. Or whatever his actual name is. I think I hear some emotional baggage here. Fuck. God damn it. <laughs> what? Okay, establish what side. Okay, that side. God damn you. Need to go to that side to be have a place to actually go. Where is the switch? Oh wow, I just did like literally all like 360 degree check before I actually found it. Okay. Just go. Is that a penny over there? It's like right up here. It's like this way. There you go. And look at this. I did see this. Oh, a little bacon figment. I saw this on Lark's stream, unfortunately, so I got kind of spoiled that all the Psychic Six are up here. You look so young. <laughs> He's just sitting there jamming. Uh, yes. Just being his best self. Back in the day. But now I'm a little, um, all over the place. But I'm sure if Cassie keeps tending her beehives, I'll come back <laughs> to my old self someday. You're deluded, Cassie. I like it yawning. It's so cute. Look at all these pictures. Cassie's family and such, I guess. Look, there's her in Compton. With the bees! It just looks like a drawing. Okay. Nice. You. Agent Bull? Hello, little boy. Can you help me get into the literature? Wing? He's definitely said Agent Bull with a question mark, but the subtitles had a period. This game sucks. I do get game so sucks. Overwhelmed without Cassie here to help. He doesn't have his She's little so chastity hat. You know. She's my best friend. Why isn't she helping you? I don't know. Where is she? <laughs> <laughs> He's so hey, bored. What you thinking about? Oh, nothing. I just post like this so people think I'm smart and thinking all the time. <laughs> I'm a little fool of myself. <laughs> hey, Otto. Jesus. What you thinking about? Oh, nothing. I just I post helmet. like this oh, so people you. think I'm smart thank and you thinking very much. all the time. I'm a little fool thank of myself. Thank you. Excuse me. <laughs> Bob Zanotto? He's a little stained. Uh, what? Excuse me? So you oh. stained with booze. Hello. What are you doing up here? Not sure. Probably something to do with plants, I'll bet. <laughs> I was always really into that kind of stuff. <laughs> his voice, I swear I've heard his voice actor before. In something else. Here's Maligma Balls. Lucretia? Lucretia Mux? Please call me Lucy. Same voice actor as Nona. Hi. I don't want to make things <laughs> awkward, but you kind of murdered my grandma. <laughs> Oh, yeah. My grandma is kid, but uh, I don't doubt it. <laughs> I murdered a lot of To people. me, it was Tuesday. It's the, she's M. Bison. Why did you murder all those people? This is fucked up. I don't really know. I was the nicest person during my time at Green Needle College. Mm. 
This is this is of course these are all Cassie's versions of the the people she knows. So she's just trying to make sense of their emotions from her own perspective, which is really cool. I like that. Right. Hydraulics. I think that was mentioned before. But nobody listened to her as usual. Don't you also go by an Yes, my name is also oh, Ligma Balls. Colloquio Max Maligula. Colloquio's bone Colloquio wet Wanda. Wet Wanda. The last <laughs> one was a stage name <gasps> for a month that was banned in three countries. What the fuck? What the fuck was that lore? Did you used to be friends with Cassie? Cassie tried to be friends with me, but I was too busy making Google eyes at Fort Crawler. <laughs> I ruined everything, you know. <laughs> so before you became a <clears throat> I'm always reminded of Raz's dad at the end of the first game, or like the demon dad in his mind. Complicated kid. That's like, gosh, I hate seeing my son be happy. <laughs> I'm gonna go. Try not to kill anybody. <laughs> okay, I'll try. <laughs> no promises. <laughs> Well, ooh, oh, sneaky! I think I hear something. Look at that sneaky! I'm glad it was pointed out with a with a figment. God, I don't even have the tag for that. Oh, how embarrassing! I'm gonna need to come back up here too. He's going like. Oops. Anything special up here? Yep. Oh, look, some clipping. Some nice clipping errors. Uh, okay. That's that. I suppose... Are these real constellations? I don't really see any ones that I know. That could be... Actually, that could be Cassiopeia right there. I think that's Cassiopeia. Do the rest of them also represent the other Psychic Six? I just realized one of them is named after a constellation. And it's the one shaped like Waluigi's mustache. Okay. Well, I'm gonna need to come back up here eventually, but... Whatever. Alright, now this area, I figure... What what happened, I bet, with those little, like, B, like, platforming zones? I bet... Am I gonna be able to access those again? I don't know. I kinda feel like the figments will have gotten booted out of there, like any figments I missed. And we'll just be in the real world now. But we'll see. No, maybe I can just go right back into the book. Oh, look at that. Oh! Hey! Hey! I don't need the money, of course, but I'll take the money. These are actually timed out to be platformable upon. You're looking jolly, downright platformable today. Oh wait, there's a figment up there. Looks like I can just go right back into the book. What's up with that mirror? Oh, also I can just do this. Nice. <laughs> okay. Now. Yeah, I know I can teleport back with the little oatmeal thing, but uh, I'll need to get out my archetype and do that globe thing again, is all. <clears throat> B. 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 Buzz. B. 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 Buzz. B. B. Yep. Alright, back into the book. I don't know if I got all these. I saw the word sexta there. So, for instance, how the fuck do I get this one? From the other page? Ah. It's kind of cool that we actually get to do these segments again. I was not expecting that. Some of the other areas were just so vacant. They're so, so just empty, like, uh, Hollis's world and Compton's world, just like, bruh. Okay, that was it, wow. 
Yeet. Here's where I got my ability. Nice. So, like, the level connections are still here in this one. What's that book even say? Hold on. No, sad. Also, I love how you go into this tunnel and it curves around and it's through a big stack of books like that. That is so awesome. History's best doors! Lol. Funny. Uh, is there... Look. Look at all these book stacks here. Just asking to be clombed upon. Sad. <sighs> Invisible walls everywhere. So unfortunate. So unfortunate. So sad. We can't climb on books for ten years. Mario Galaxy ass music. Sad. Okay, I'm done. I haven't used the dive at all. There were really in in all of Helmut's world, there were only two of those spinny uh. platforms. I swear they must be somewhere else in the game, because I remember there being more of those. Uh, okay. Little whimsical friend. I love the look of this world. It's just so cool. Uh-oh. <clears throat> me, uh... I even have to care about this. I already got all the figments. Oh look, all the NPCs are gone from this area. Maybe that's just because there's a battle going on. Um. Oh, the dragon. Wait, 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 wait. The dragon is the only one there. What? Let me at least go talk to the dragon. I don't know why I'm just ignoring these guys. Just fight them. Yo, did he kill? He burnt the guy. What happened to your night friend? Oh, uh, what the fuck? What the fuck? What pile of ash? What a plot twist! Oh, the knight like that there. He's coming back for it later. This pile of ash. He murdered him. Also, it took control away from me for like exactly one of those dialogue interactions for some reason. It's Only the second the one. Not the first, not the third, the second. Okay. I don't see any figments. Time to go. This is this was the room where I like got up there actually. Hold on. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. Oh, look at him flying. Oh my god. What the fuck? He's a superhuman. No. Whoop their asses. Burn them all. <laughs> look at them all go. They're just freaking the fuck out in there. But this enabler is not doing anybody any real good. Nice. Slow down the burning process. Accentuate their pain. Get out of here. Very sloppy combat. Wow, oh, there's a lot of these guys. Cool. Really cool. Oh, fuck this. Of all the battle arenas, it was the one I didn't want to do again. Gay! You said gay. They skip even when they're on fire. Yeah, shoot. <clears throat> Howdy, bitch. That's the way to do it. No. I'm just always reminded of the, the French sensors in the first game that say non- He's got a dodge roll. Oh, what? Did he leave the time bubble or something? What's going on? 
Looks like he was still in it. Okay. Stop with the enemies. I just want to explore this room. There's still another guy? Fuck you. He felt like he was in the time bubble. <laughs> Cracking his knucks at me. That's a two swing. Alright. Oh, there's all the guys. Nice. They all came out of hiding. I can't believe the dragon fucking killed the knight. That's so fucked up. That's effed in the B. Okay, well that took way longer than it should have. Perhaps. See where even I actually did this. Fuck. My I really depth perception the hell out of that one. I think it was from up here actually. It was off this light. This music is making me think of Breath of the Wild. Anyone else get that vibe from it? On that, hell yeah. <clears throat> We're back over here, climbing books. Like God intended. And like Tim Schafer did not intend. Jim Schaffered, creator of Double Fine. Hmm. <laughs> nice. Ah! No! Close. No. I gotta get around to that side of the book. Nope. Oh. Hold on. Is there a better... There's probably a better way to be doing this. But it worked once. God damn it. Hold on. See if I can get up this. Oh shit. Oh no. That's uh that's a little reset moment. I think this didn't this exact thing happen another time I came up here. Is there anything that could no. Sad. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, are you kidding me? It's been 20 minutes since I saved. And the game doesn't let you save manually. That's just auto-save. Bruh. Literally bruh. I- People are saying spam. Sorry, spam what? Spam what exactly? I can't make the levitation ball come out. That little sound? That's the sound of me not being able to take it out. But that's the sound of me not being able to do that. So I think I need to lose 20 minutes of progress here. What the fuck? The, the camera is also stuck now. It's literally also stuck. Oh, wait. Whoa. Oh, I did it. I did it. Something happened that let me do it. The fuck? The fuck? Okay. Oh, back to this. Something just, like, snapped in the game that let me just get out. For some reason. <laughs> how was I able to- how did I do that before? I- I'm kind of scared that I was able to do this before, and now I can't do it at all. There we go. Now... Get on the ball. The OxyClean detergent ball. There we go. That's the way to do it. Careful. Those, those are the goal. I don't know if we're gonna be able to do it though. Oh shit. I can jump on this. Oh my God. It's kind of hard to see. Hold on, there's glare on the TV. So stand on that. Yeah! This is that guy that climbs the books, right? That's all he does? 
fucking weird streamer. I don't know what his obsession is with climbing on books. He does it every single stream. <laughs> this is nuts. I am tallest thing in the room. Nice. Look at these fucking things. They look so kooky and weird. Let's go step on them. <laughs> nice. That's just cool. Not really supposed to be platforming on these, of course, but here we are. I'm a sneaky, cheeky man. Doesn't follow the rules. Um, I don't suppose there's anything I can do over here, is there? There's nothing I can actually, like, you know, use this for, but it's just fun. Big ass stack of books. That's a god? No, GL. That said God for a second. These are the- this is where I keep my books about the Lord. The Bibble, for instance. Nice, okay. And... Weeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
through normal means. Fuck you. Okay. Now. I think we are done with this area. Talk to the teleport guy to get the hell out of here. No big things to climb up on in here. I think that one room was the only one with those big, schwisty ones. This is the room where I, f I was on that stack of books down there and I climbed back up, but we already, we've already done that. Teacher's domain. Okay, I'm assuming this is where the rest of the shit is. Uh, the steamer trunk tag. Did I get that? I'm curious. No. And we still got one more nugget. Uh, really not that many figments at all, just three. But we've got so much baggage. Look, her thing is shaped like her book. Her weird fucking, like, Hollow Knight hive mind book. I feel like I didn't even go through... I, I feel like I missed a room. It's the one that's connected to the, the like, main librarian area, actually. Because there's... I only did two of the book segments, right? That's what I'm thinking. Oh, hell yeah. Double my money. Good shit. Good. I actually need health. Can't go to fall right in the water. I wonder if that doesn't heal you. The health has to actually be out of the box for that to work. <gasps> oh, fuck. Thought I could do that without touching the water. Maneuver my way out there. Okay. Um. This is a. This is such. This is one of the best parts of the game. This little. This part of this world. It almost feels like this is the main part of the world, and then they sort of like tacked on other parts of it too, because this also has the like three structure, you know? Which I don't mind the parts that may or may not have been tacked on. I'm just, you know. I'm just postulating. Um, oh, I just accidentally. I didn't even see that figment, but I picked it up. Wow, okay. I didn't even notice it, but it, I just collected it. Convenient. One more. Oh, do I see? I see a luggage there. Nice. Very nice. We are making fast progress on this. Oh, and there's the other figment. Wait. I think I hear some. Look at that. There's the last figment. Easy. Easily done. Simple. Hell yeah. That's one of those star figments that we saw coming out of Helmut Full Bear. He put that there. Okay. GG. Wow, those even told me GG. Sounds like that part of the music sounds like uh, Team Rocket music. Okay. Nice. That was, that was easy. I need to get the, uh, I still have a tag and a trunk left to go. Oh, wow. Yep, da 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 Menuing is fun. Yeah, all the figments. I need a nugget of wisdom and tag for that one thing. Uh, what? Hold on. Let me, uh... Check through chat. I didn't, I didn't see, uh... Did, it, did anybody... Oh, look at that. Wait, is that... You're joking. Look at that. Wait, wait, wait! Literally everything was right here! <laughs> the tag is right up there, and the nugget is right there. Literally, like, everything was right here. Everything I needed was, like, within sight of each other. The fuck? I, I just keep, like, happening to turn my head to see. What the fuck? 
It's on a big pile of books. This is my calling. <laughs> Book stack streamer. Coming to a theater near you. The slow pan to success. That was so funny, the way everything was just sort of there. Right where I needed it. It was just, I guess it was just there was one area I did not explore very thoroughly. <gasps> Almost fell off there. That was so easy. Literally easiest game I've ever played in my life. Oh my god. Uh, so now I just need to go actually get that baggage. Cool. Now what or who is controlling her mind to keep her from helping with the bees? I think we're probably coming up on our... This This might be the last luggage to sort. I don't know about that, but... Uh, actually, no, I think there was some left in Bob's world, if I recall correctly. Shit. Uh... Get back to the little teleportation guy. This little fella. <sighs> Fuck you. I hate you. I can still make it. Nice. I love that. And also, I just like accidentally. This whole world, 100%ing this, I just like stumbled upon everything perfectly. It was like I just instantly went down to there where there was a figment. Instantly, like, walked through a figment accidentally and then just zoned in on everything else. Could you give me a lift? Whack. I didn't even need to do the other, uh, the other book segment that I, I think I missed. I think maybe if I'd gone in that door there. Actually, no, I think that was just like, check back here when you've got all the evidence, you know. Okay. One last time climbing up this fucking, uh, what's the like easy way? This is not the easy way. Okay. This sounds like the song that I played at the beginning of the stream. Just a little bit. Tiny vague about. My, yes, here we are! Let's see here. Yes, Cassie's level. That was the one that went down like a little bitch. Meow. There he goes. See, sometimes he's just a little hokey cokey. Here I go. There's the rail. I hate you. <laughs> and I love that the badge that shuts him up doesn't even truly shut him up. He just like is muffled. Okay. Let's go back around here and get this guy. There you are, big fella. Cassie's emotional bag cool. is all sorted. Guess we still got some in Bob's mind, though. Let's try to get all the mines today. How about that? I was thinking of saving Bob's mind for tomorrow, but that was super quick. May I trouble you for a bubble? Take me out of here. It also still reminds me of that music. It's just fun to look at them all when they're all 100%ed. Except for this one. Wow, and did I even... I got all the nuggets, it looks like, and all the memory vaults, which are the easier ones to get. Well, this place is improved. Bob really uh, does have a green thumb. Has it improved? It looks basically identical. I don't mean to roast hey, the guy. How's it going? 
Oh, you know, inch by nice. inch, row by row. Mind if I sail around and tie up some loose ends? Okay, but listen. I remember I whoever sings that song. Is that like Paul Simon? Okay. I'm going to make myself gotcha. look like an ignoramus Proceed. here. Whoever Proceed. sings that song, he was on the Muppets. And he sang that song. Gonna make my garden grow. And, uh... It was very good. It stuck in my mind. I really liked that, that tune. Uh, yeah. Where? Wait. Where's my boat? Do I get to? Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay. Thank you. All right. Let's take a peek around. Something that I saw Lark find while he was streaming that I never encountered was uh, on some of these islands. There's like Bob's brain. Wow. We're in Bob's brain, guys. Bob's brain versions of different characters. So this is his perception of Lily. So what are you doing out here? Just trying to stay away. And from he doesn't know what her voice sounds news. like. Bob's and Anna was actually really nice once you get to know him. Don't worry, he'll let you down eventually. Huh. Bob's and Anna was actually really nice once you get to know him. Don't worry, he'll okay. let you down eventually. There, when Lark was streaming this, she even joked about the Bob's voice. Okay, but nice. I guess we don't get to hear Once that voice line. Weird. Don't worry, he'll let you down Crap. eventually. Ah, here's the hat box tag. Is that a figment too? That's a that's a figment that is easy to miss. Hot damn, does that blend in? I'm glad I uh, noticed that. Okay. Some explodey plants here that I just always get hit by literally every time. This world's awesome. I think I hear some emotional back. <laughs> it's nice to have like some new stuff to explore here. Okay. Um This reminds me so much of that, like, blender art that I put up at the beginning of that one stream, too. Okay, I kind of want to do all the overworld shit at once. Look, the Kraken is there. Oh, what's Kraken, Jim? Oh, what the fuck is happening? See, I'm not going to pretend that was a good hue, because it wasn't. But if I was recording memes in Hugh Neutron's voice, I would, I would step up the quality a bit. You know, I would get in the hue zone. That moon is... Barely moon-shaped. What? Oh. I think the boat just appears whenever you go to the end of a dock. I didn't need to, uh... I thought I needed to go back to it. Oh, well. And the sailing music is so lovely. Ba -ba -ba -ba. We get these. Crack a lacking. Nice. I'm on the other side of the world. Look, this is what I was talking about in uh, Grow Home. We're in the shadow of the earth. Isn't that trippy to think about? Conked into that one. Look at that. You can see half of that tree is illuminated. That's a really cool effect. I kind of fucking adore that. Okay, let's check out this island. Look, there's Truman. The entire time in this game, could you say that Nick was putting on a Truman show? I bet people have already made that joke. Uh, where's a dock here? There we go. I'd like to dock with you, Truman Zanato. Fuck. Look, steamer trunk is there. I just never explored in this world, I guess. Because I never found any of these little You're fired. islands. <laughs> you can't fire me. You're fired. Is that all you're going to say to me, Truman? You think I won't fire family? <laughs> this is all he thinks about in regard to Truman, is that he fired him. Which, fair enough. Truman Zanato, the biggest homophobe on the planet. He doesn't like homey psychsuals. Is that gonna blow me up? I think I hear something. Nice. I'm glad I have the tag for this. Okay. Another one. 
crab, Rasputin. That's a crab. Are we back to the other island already? Oh, look. The Northern Lights. I'm going to hit you so hard, you're going to see Northern Lights. This is Helmut's bottle, I think. I-I-R-C. Let's just take a peek around. It's fun to just roll around on the ball in this world. Do you guys think they would make, uh... You know, I, I heard some people being like, Oh, Psychonauts HD! Do you think they would do that? I would, I mean... I, I would expect maybe something along the lines of Grim Fandango Remastered, but I don't think they would, like, remake the first game in this engine or anything crazy like that. But they might they might go nuts, I don't know. Uh, before I go in any of the bottles, I want to, like, check the rest of the world here. Okay. Rasputin. I always think about the like ghost, the, like water ghost at the end of the first game. Hey, that's Bob's Island. Bob's your uncle. Um, I think over here. There's some stuff. Hold on. Uh, wait, what is this? Oh, it's auto. There's not even anything here. Just auto. Hey, auto. Glad Bob still keeps some friends around. <laughs> friends? Please. <laughs> you and Bob aren't friends? See, sometimes it wrests control from you, like there it did on the second line, again. I can't control the camera, I can't move around. They were kind of a package deal. Wow. He's hard on himself. In his perceptions of other people. Yeah, we only put up with him because he was with the other guy. I don't know why it locks you down with some voice lines, but not with others. It seems kind of random. We also needed his vegetables. Rude. You and Bob were good friends. The truth is, we all saw Helmet with someone taller. <laughs> you and Bob were good friends. The truth is, uh, yeah, hold we all on. saw Helmet with someone taller. What is... huh? Behind Otto's house? Oh. People were saying there was a figment. I was like, hmm? And someone said behind his house. Um, okay. So, let me poke around a little more, see what I see. I don't really have a good sense of direction in regard to this orb world, frankly. Uh, did I already... I don't know if I already parked at this one. Is that his mom bottle? I think it's his mom bottle. I just kind of want to, like, totally clear out this overworld, although I, I kind of... It's going to be a little tricky to do. Before I go teleporting around. That's not... That, like, red stink. Keeps making me think there's, like, figments around. But no, that's just red stink in the air. I don't know why. I feel like there were figments that were just, like, sitting around. Someone said that I missed figments near Truman, by the way. Oh, God. Like, that plant one there? Oh, God. That is so fucking sneaky. Oh shit, no, get off. Look at that shit. That is very sneaky. There's another one here. The fuck? 
Anything else? Uh. Anything here? <clears throat> Jesus, those are... Those are... Real fucking hard to see. Like, I, I noted with the other one that looked like that. Those are fucking insanely difficult to see. <laughs> Like, that shit is- that shit is whack. Just don't make him, like, green. That's like normal plant color. That seems like a no-brainer, but whatever. Okay. Give to me. Um, now go over here. Slam into the dock. Yeet. That is so fucked up. There's some very fucking sneaky figments in this world. It's like now I feel obligated to like check around these every time too. Okay, I feel comfortable. I, I may have still missed something, but I feel comfortable going into the bottle now. Shit, I tried to jump right before, but I cut it too close. By the way, I a lot of people still were like, "Oh, it's the water hand was always just Raz's psycho, or it, it was his psychic subconscious, or whatever." But like, you can, it, I'm still a little confused because like, we still, it's still physically impossible to go into water, and I know from a game design perspective that's just like a limitation, basically. Like they can't just make swimming controls, just for lore reasons, or like you know. It's a little... That's a bit excessive, I guess. But, uh... It's just... It, it's a little narratively confusing, because I, I, I still am not certain if that means that it's just Maligula is doing it and she's just chill now, or if, uh... It's really Raz's subconscious and they just didn't want to program... Water controls, basically. Uh... Hope I'm not missing anything in... Here, let's just have titanium in them. I'm so glad this is still intact. What the fuck was up with? Okay, some of these yep. worlds got so butchered. Why did they like butcher Hollis's world, for instance? In uh, when when you go back to it, where they cut off all the different like cool connections, but here they're still there. Like, just leave all that shit in. That gave a real bad first impression, Hollis's world, of, of like, going back, you know? Fuck. Uh, uh, uh. I don't think we ever heard that voice line. Put me down, wretched demon! Okay. Mm. To the right, to the left. Far and wide, with the shriek of a damned spirit to my heart. There's so the many voice lines for them the for this. Tiger. Like Lark was saying, oh man, repeating voice lines. But I was noting when I was playing this that I don't think I think we barely ever heard any repeating voice lines. Here? I don't know if it's there's any RNG or if they cycle through or what. Yeah, did I uh, give me a One second more here? Time around the block, Jeeves. See if I can pull this off. This work. Oh. Fucking brilliant. Hey, I can see your house from here. Oh, look at oh my green? god. Wait. You're kidding me. Okay. These are stupid. They, these these plant ones that are green. This seems like a no-brainer. Make them like pink or something to stand out. I, I kind of think those are dumb. Like, make them like fucking magenta. That shit blends in like crazy. Oh, fuck. I jumped while happened? bouncing. I have an air sickness bag. Yeah. 
You know, my guy did a little bounce, and I tried hitting the jump button while he was in midair from the little bounce. Thanks for the lift, by the way. I don't know if there's any like underwater that I need to watch out for. I think I already got whatever that is. Feed something. Hi, have you met I'm gonna my just friend? check anyway. They just love to fly and fly. <laughs> <laughs> the dialogue? Okay. It's so weird. Because so often when games try to be funny, I'm just like, Cringe, me, you know? So but here, this sea. game constantly is making me chuckle, and I just love that. It's just a testament to, like, Let actual half-decent writing, demon. what it will do. Oh, fuck. I didn't realize that was slidey. Does anyone have, um, a, have an air sickness bag? That line we hear plenty, I guess. The air sickness bag one. Gonna assume that those work exactly the same as the books, and possibly even have the exact same collision and programming behind them, just with different visuals. Like, what's a what's a shitty comedy game? Sunset Overdrive. <laughs> From what I heard, it wasn't even like bad. It was just uh, you know not terribly funny. God, I'm- now I'm- I feel like a figment just could be anywhere. Mm -hmm. Um... I feel like we stood on top of this thing at a certain point. You know you can, like, literally get banned from this channel for shit-talking Poker Night at the inventory, right? You know that- you know, that's true. It's in the rules. Read the rules. Someone show this man the door. Uh... That's just titanium up there, I think. I don't see anything. I think these- these segments I cleared pretty, pretty comprehensively. I don't know. There's probably some stuff I missed, but I feel like I did get a lot of stuff. Uh, okay. The float is so good. The float ability. I just love- I, I even just love the sound effect that it makes when it pops. It's just got a satisfying noise. Oh, that's not an actual platform. Brilliant. <laughs> the, th the game, like, censored it. And that- and that water hand- Oh, it wasn't propping him up. No, it was going- Right up there. Time for your exam. This is supposed to be Bob's mom. I only now understand. And she's drowning in alcoholism, because she passed it on to him. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, I... God, uh... I'm so nervous that I've missed figments. I really don't see any, uh, stuff. I mean, the... the hat box tags, or the hat- or the... luggage tags. They really stick out like a sore thumb. Also, the thing froze because I touched the inner rim of it. I rimmed it. Hmm. Actually, how many, uh, figments are left in this world, just so I know? We are so close to getting, like, the achievements, you know? 156 out of 165. I mean, you just need one more half a mind and uh, one more luggage. Cool. This is this. It's the end of this. 
<laughs> I don't see any stuff. Figments are really the thing that I'm on the lookout for. So I didn't really get this segment first, going through it at first, but now, yes. She was sneaking out to the greenhouse for a kip to just take a drink. And that's why all the plants were dead, and that's why she couldn't take him to his, like, recital or anything. She's constantly going out to the greenhouse. And then when he went in there after she was dead, we saw this in his memory vault. The plants were holding out the bottles for him. Look at that plate. Hold on, is this game about, like, magic or something? What am I expected to believe? That this is some sort of... Haunted psychic plate? I hope someone got fired for that blunder. The game saved. I think originally this just... You automatically jump down here during a cutscene. So it would be cruel if there were pickups on the rim here. But are there? Kinda doubt it. No, I don't, I don't see anything. Nor do I hear anything. Normally, co Raz comments on such things. Oh look, our little guy is here. So yeah, all the like teleport spots or all the uh, level transitions in this level, for instance, seem to be intact. Or actually, no, I guess this is a dead end. As I'm saying this. Oh no, wait, I can go in there. Oh. Yep. Never mind. I'm talking myself in a circle here. The connections are still there. Uh, okay. Jesus. So we did we did the mommy bottle. Now let's go do Truman bottle, I guess. I don't actually is this Truman bottle or is this helmet? This is no, this is mommy bottle again. Whoa. Shwoosh! Now... Red for love, red for blood. Or red for Truman Zanotto. I believe this is red for Truman Zanotto. Okay, um, sad. I thought those were figments for a second. Oh, I see a figment there. But I somehow missed. Hooks. The hooks! There's a little thing to plant Onion Bob in. But we're, I don't think the Onion Bob is actually here. Um... Any figments? I don't see any. Alright. Now. No, wait. There you go. <laughs> Let's use that dive for the second time this stream. Yeah! Here's this room. This is the room that was in the trailer. It was all over the trailer. Oh, can you see through the world geometry there? Look at that little white spot behind that waterfall. This was in the trailer, and I I, I went back and watched the trailer again, because I'd only seen the trailer, like, one time, briefly, because I didn't want to, like, spoil myself too much. Oh, shit. But then uh, I looked back at it, and this room was prominently featured several times in the trailer, which is funny because... Uh, Oh, see you in hell. That was a quote from the first game. Uh, and it's also a quote from like everything ever. But it's funny because maybe when, maybe when the game was, uh, or before the game came out, people might have thought, "Oh no, the Psychonauts." In fact, it would have fed into my uh, damn theory that the Psychonauts headquarters would get like flooded at some point. But no, this is just inside this guy's alcoholism brain. It's just vodka. 
That little air horn is so annoying. Get out of here. Okay. But that, uh... I bet people had some fucking, like, theories from the trailer of, like, oh, Psychonauts headquarters clearly gets flooded at some point. But no, it turns out it's just someone's brain. Look at that flamingo strutting. Those enemies are just there to, like, encourage you to use pyrokinesis on big groups of enemies, I feel like. Okay. Oh. Okay. Still running. What? I saw a bad mood. Okay, I was gonna say, I saw a bad mood start to spawn in and then he just left. He left and made the sound of picking up a coin in Insane Aquarium, for some reason. Almost I just need to focus. If I can find the cause of this bad mood, maybe I can get rid of it. It's good that, like, when you, when your perspective changes there, that the controls don't start sucking ass. Because that feels like the sort of thing that would happen. Okay. Oh uh, yeah, somebody said don't forget the grass figments. Don't worry, uh, if I- if I see a figment, if I perceive one, I- I- I will- I will go pick it up. It's less forgetting and more that I just don't see them. That's- that's like not really a forgetting thing. Okay, I guess it's just this. Okay, um... Okay. Look, this one's like, burst. There's the Dark Souls 2 beta out there. Uh, not seeing anything in this dark area, you would think they would glow. Fuck. Let's just go this way. I think I already got everything in this room, but might as well check. Why does it sound like we're walking on a bottle? That is not what tablecloth sounds like. Is that a misplaced footstep sound effect? Genuinely? Wait, what the fuck? What even was happening there? That was a weird glitch. The footstep sounds were mixed up. That was very bizarre. Okay, and I think a memory vault was here. I don't think that was part of the music. I'm, I'm gonna say I am 100% certain that was not part of the music. That was the exact sound you make when you walk on the bottles, but I was definitely not walking on a bottle. Okay. Um, Wait a second, what am I doing up here? Hmm. Okay. Hello down Shit. There. Made a horrible <sighs> mistake. Damn it. I thought maybe I could slick it. I was a fool. 
Come on. Fuck that. Up in the air, junior. Wow, I am really man. blowing chunks at this part. I just keep trying to speed through it. Imagine if Bob had knocked me back. Okay, so we know there is... Oh, actually, the, I know exactly where the suitcase is, or where the uh, purse or whatever I need to get is. Uh, also, Helmut Fulbear was a cactus when he became a plant, and his signature move in the boss fight is those, like, bomb-type things. Is this lore? Nice. Still, is, we still get to do this? All these cool transitions. Why did they fuck up Hollis's level so much upon returning to it? I kind of hate that. It's just that one got really fucked up for some reason. Uh, I didn't miss anything back there, did I? I need to look back down there. What the fuck? Oh. Okay. Oh, look at those. Wait. I think I already got that. I, I remember getting that. Okay. This was all the wedding figments. We are very near the uh, the purse or whatever that is, whatever suitcase. I think I hear this is the last thing. The final one. Yeah, you're it. Tag sale. You're it. Hell yeah. Feels good, man. Uh, I've still got a fair amount of figments, though. Uh, did I miss a grass one before? Is that confirmed? Oh, wait, there's a figment up there. Actually, there's two figments up there. Actually, wait, is there one on top of that, too? No, that's a straw. Because I saw someone said there was a there was one in the overworld that I missed. But people were talking about the grass ones. Did I actually miss one? Okay, so don't go in there. Go up here and do this. Nice. Nice, like, themed wedding. Gay! Wait, can I go up here? Oh my god, I bet this is where, like, everything is. Nope. Just this half of mind. Nice. I think that's, uh, full heart containers for the game. That's pretty cool. I don't think there are half a mines in the over overworld. Maybe there are. I know I can check in the menu. I'm just asking uh, the person that said something about like grass figments. It's not because I missed one, is it? Okay, I think we're good here. Oh, is this maybe a connection that is no longer a thing? Okay. Fair enough. We found one. Let's go have a, have a chat with this guy. Um, okay. Now, let's go to, uh... You know, let's try doing this, actually. Tia. I never even noticed that she had a name, Tia. Thanks for the ride. Let's see if I can just do this. Nice. Oh, good God. Look at that. Look how much that blends in. Yeah, this, this overworld has got some stanky figments. That is insane. <laughs> that is so fucked. Hold on, let me just make sure. Feel the need to check all the other trees now. Sad. Okay. Now. Let's go to the teleport guy. Or actually, I guess down here is easier to go to the teleport guy. Give me the money. Hey, little 
buddy. Now get I me out of here. All right. Um, let's go up here. Got a little bubble juice in my nose that time. <laughs> I hate that line. Why do we keep having to hear it? The bubble juice in your nose. Okay, um, so going down there, yeah, everything's just different. Oh, wait, is that a figment? No, that's a gumdrop. Let's, uh, go down here and take a peek around. It's just a cool little hole. Okay. Oh, that sends me back. Okay. Man, that really sends me back. Okay, um, I don't think there were any figments in depression zone. So, give me a second here. A what? Well, I assume there's nothing to get down there, because I don't see anything, and I think that was just the exit that that warp would have taken me to. So I'm going to go up to depression zone. Oh, man. I just feel like they really could have made this a lot less awkward to control. It's like, have the character constantly in the same rhythm. Here they have it so that, okay, you're in a rhythm, and when you swap directions, they just instantly stop. It's like, no. Have them constantly be swinging pendulously back and forth, but when you switch directions, they just switch directions, and they don't just stop completely in their tracks. That's how to fix this control. I think that's one thing that is still kind of marred from the first game, honestly, in terms of control scheme. Oh, this is just... This is just a mouth now. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Damn, I, I bet we can't even see the depression cutscene again. Okay. Well, clearly I, uh, missed some shit. I don't think... Oh, wait, look at that. That's a different cake? Or something? I don't even know what's going on down there, actually. Weird, because I see, like, the forest we came from... There's, like, a secondary cake. Okay, well, uh, is there another place to travel to? Bog of Betrothed, Sunken Mother Lobe, Ship in a Bottle. So there are a lot of figments that are just... chillin'. Five figments are just hanging out somewhere. One of those... look at that really low-res coconut. Okay, and just popped back in, never mind. It is high resolution. Um, okay, so are the ones where I have only one out of two gonna like visually pop out at me or okay one out of two in that bottle Oh man one out of two Viking helmets Jesus this might be something I might have to do off stream I know that's kind of unsatisfying, but you guys don't want to see me just like bumble around for ages <laughs> so three unique figments and then uh and then a bottle and a viking helmet good god uh yeah oh right wait the sliding oh my god that's probably where literally all of them are may i trouble you for a bubble oh my god wait I think Bog of the Betroth, that connection doesn't actually exist, so let's go Bob's Island. I think, like, almost all of these are going to be in the slide. Because I missed a few in there, right? I hope they're all in there. Uh, Yellow for Helmut Full Bear, I think. <laughs> I keep thinking that's one, like, floating in the air, too. But I don't think it is. It's just pink gas. A 
Okay. Huge ass. Helm nut full bear. Bear ass. Got one. Oh, come on. Please, please, give me four more. Oh, fuck you. Uh, oh. There's one. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, no. Ah, oh, I missed. I missed. Oh. It, no, this, this doesn't work. Hold on, can I do like... <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Oh god, but then beyond that, there's also one more. Hey, little buddy. That sucks. I need to get somewhere quick. That sucks a lot. I, what do you want to bet it's one, like, bullshit one in the overworld? That seems to be where all the, like, really dumb figments are. Good. If you even slightly touch an island, you're coming to a complete and full stop. I feel like there's just, like, some, like, tree or patch of grass or something. Okay, let me see my character. Let's go slow. It's a long thing. Get it! Get it! For the love of God! There you go. That one's weirdly difficult to do. Okay, um... I, I have no fucking idea where this last figment is. What a nightmare. Um... Can we see... Because I think I got the other bottle one. But, and then we got the other helmet one. I really wish there was something to make the ones that you don't have all of, like, visually pop out. Like, they're grayed out, but some of the figments are literally gray. <laughs> so it also doesn't, it doesn't really help that much. Uh, or like, dark-ass green to the point where they just look gray. I'm not seeing any one out of twos here. Or one out of anything, or... Any of that shit. And I know just by process of elimination, I could look it up still. I feel like it's just going to be some bullshit. Look behind the bottle at the bottom of the slide. I think I did already. And actually, that's like the Dark Souls 2 area. Where there's just nothing. In fact, oh, is that is that just because it looks cool? I'm not saying there's a figment there. It does look cool. I never really realized it curves like that. Breath from above. <laughs> so I, I think I think Google might be my thing. I've, I've seen commenting about the the fridge, the fridge, because I, I I don't fucking there's a lot of fridges, right? But but now they've specified the portal fridge. Not me back to your nest to, uh, uh, I think I checked, something. but I don't know. If that's just like a random guess, and it's not like you saw, it's not like you watched the stream and saw me miss it. Uh, random guesses just don't work on on stream like that. Thanks, buddy. You know. But I I can go check because I have no other ideas. Oh, here it is. What the fuck? A telephone. Wow. What a bunch of prick figments in this world. Uh, this is a great world, but why did they feel the need to put so many douche-ass figments in this world? That's it. That's all the figments in the game? Collected every figment in this mine. What does that say? Fig-headed. What does that even mean? Like, pig-headed? Big-headed? Well, I did it, folks. That's all the mental stuff. All the baggage, all the nuggets, I believe. 
Look at that, just all check marks, all check marks all the way down. Shit feels good. Wasn't the most satisfying thing ever. Honestly, it wasn't as fun as I thought it was going to be. But Hooey, <whistles> some of those figments in that world were dumb. The, like some of the, just the grass ones, the ones that blend in really well with the environment. Get those out of there. Make them fucking bright pink. You know? Uh, and now, I might even get a little bit of a start on some of these zones. 26 out of 27 challenge cards, 1 out of 2 supply chests. Let's try to find the last couple things in Green Needle Gulch. How about that? Could you give me a lift? Hey, could you give me a lift? Shut up. Let's go look at them all. Well, thank you. I, I do appreciate... The, the help from chat saved me a lot of fucking consternation and just walking around being like, uh, where the fuck is anything? So I do appreciate that. Look at all that. I did it. Bull's World didn't even have... Or no, it's four for each one. Never mind. This is, his door is just a lot less extravagant. He's a, he's a meek man. A small man. Okay. Get out of here. Hep, 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 hep. Hep, 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 hep. Also, there were really, like... I'm trying to think. That one spot in Helmut Fulbear's level, that was the only place that we saw today where there were those spinning platforms. I feel like those were in another world, but I don't remember which. I feel like th th we definitely saw those spinning platforms somewhere else, right? Because otherwise, I'm just going to go back there at a certain point. Maybe not. Um, okay. Green Needle Gulch. Take me down to the there. Um, in Nick's head. Oh, yeah, maybe? I'll have to check. Maybe I'll check off stream. Okay. Heptadome. Heptatomy. So I'm just going to try to get one chest and one card just to cross off this overworld area. Um... It's like, let the camera sit still and see if you see anything fluttering around. This is gonna be... it's a huge area to try to find one card. Of course. So let's just start from the beginning. And try to be thorough. Boy. I think we already got everything there is to get here, but to check. Did they reuse that hollow log in Bob's brain? I love that it's Bob's brain. That's so funny to me. Oh look, are they just having a good old chat now? I never actually I... talked to them after the game ended. Resputin. You're the you're the villain. I have much on my mind. But I want you to know that in my heart, you are my grandson. My second favorite grandson. Uh. Well, that certainly sounds like something my Nona would say. Cool. What are you two gonna do now? We are going We're to have psychic orgies and get zonked. <sighs> Make sure Lucy's okay. Oh, I'm fine. Thanks. You're to trembling. Here. She's literally shaking. She still thinks I'm creepy. I think you'll come That's what we saw when we clairvoyanced her too. Well, I need to spend at least a little time there, or else those bowling alley shoes are gonna sprout <laughs> legs and walk away. But I'd also love to take Lucy to Whisper and Rock. He thinks if he gives me all the canoe at sunset that I won't be able to resist his advantage. Mm. <laughs> okay, that's enough. He's yeah, right. gross. Okay. She looks so much older than him. What did she say there? I didn't even get to read the little captions. I don't think it said. 
What's next for the psychonauts? Something gross. Well, I'm not sure. Presumably. But, uh, if I have any influence, we'll get back to basics. Basic braining. Exploring the human mind. There's still so much mystery to explore there, Rasputin. <laughs> You're going to give your final frontier speech? I'm going to close my eyes and sleep for a bit. You keep talking. Well, I thought it was. Is she going to be awake for the next dialogue line? Yep. Have you talked to my dad yet? Not nope. Yet. Do you He's in a different zone. I think my dad will need a little time. But you know what they say about acrobats? They you know what they say. <laughs> well, I hope both are true. But basically, if I had if I had not had chat here, like when I had completed uh, Psy King Sensorium or something like that, and I had like one or two figments left that had not got like pointed out to me, you know, I would have just uh, I would have just looked it up honestly. So it's not like this game experience is much different from the one I would have had because you can deduce from the list. Deduce. Yo, drop a fat deduce right in my fucking mouth, bro. I don't know why. I'm sorry. I don't know why I said that. Hey, I'm not seeing any cards here, and I kind of doubt that I would leave them behind like that, like such a fool, but I feel it prudent to check. Barely hung on there. Actually, wasn't... I feel like I remember the exact place where the card is that we're looking for. There was, like, a card I couldn't get to way later in this zone. I think... I can't remember, but whatever. Let's just check this out anyway. Camera zooming back. Ever since that, I noticed that happened in certain places in Dark Souls 3, I've like, I feel like I've been way more in tune to noticing when that happens in other games too. And the camera pulls back for a little bit. Look at those red ass bushes. Why are they so red? What the fuck is up with those bushes? They're like the only bushes that look like that in this whole area, and they're just right there. It's blood red moss from Dark Souls. Oh, look at this, like, soul tree. So I assume we can actually go through here now. Wow. <sighs> okay. Oh, hell yeah. Hmm. Oh, but now, weird. So it was playing the questionable area music for just a second here, and now it's playing the Whispering Rock daytime music, which the first time we went through here played the Whispering Rock nighttime music. Previously, I think the only time we heard the Whispering Rock daytime music was when the other interns took my fucking pants. Still can't wait to get my hands on this soundtrack. I, I know there's, there's like multiple channels on YouTube of start started uploading songs from it. But I'm kind of just waiting to get the full thing. Actual official OST, you know. Oh! -ho -ho! Why, this rock looks like you can drop down to it. Ah! Little blood-curdling scream. Okay. So, all that was really just pointless, but whatever. Whee! Whee! The levitation ball is just so good. I wonder if one of these cobwebs is the same model. Like, that one right there is the same exact cobweb that they used in Cassie's collection on the, on the plane. I'd bet my top dollar. No, I wouldn't actually, but... I'd bet maybe, like, a dollar. Okay. Oh, wait. Did I see something fluttering? No. 
So I think there was a card over here in this zone that, uh, or right, these aren't even, these plants actually exist. Those weren't even exclusive to Bob's mental brain world. His world is fucking mental, mate. Oh look, there's a chest right there. And I got the key. Nice. Nice. Okay. I like that the vines are growing into there still. They just kind of backed off a little bit. So, let me just take a peek around. Well, we already got one of the things I was looking to get. That's good. Whoa. Whoa, that was also a railing. What the fuck? Wait, that was weird. I need to go try that again. That was very bizarre. It seems like it's sort of thing that would be bouncy, but maybe that's just because I just played Gone Home. Weird. Okay, you just briefly rail grind on that. Just a little bit of fun. Okay. Actually, no, I think we got all this. I don't think this was the zone that had the card that I missed. Hmm. I think we went over there and we got all that. I have like a vague memory of a card that I couldn't get around here. Just checked by Cassie's house. Okay, I guess here's some red plants. It's just weird that they were so concentrated in that one zone. Strangely. Get up there. Sad. Um. <laughs> Anything in here? Rustling through the bushes? It was so weird that there was a scavenger hunt item back there. hate guitars. Uh, I think I already got all that, although I could be wrong. Not responsible for death by bees! Just keeping a little eye out here. The cards have got to be the hardest thing to, to find the last of, because you can't even... Like with the figments, you can look up the figment list and sort of deduce from that. But here it's like, bruh. Okay. Oh, wait. What is that? Is that a scavenger hunt thing? I think I saw Lark get this off stream, actually. Yeah, the phone. But it's not actually a phone. Beehive shaped like my phone. <laughs> Sad. Okay. Uh, I don't suppose I can get up on this, the roofs of this house, can I? Let me just take a peek in here. I'm pretty sure. Uh, pretty sure I already got everything in here, but take a look, see around. Cool for B personas were still here, but I guess it makes sense that they're gone. This is her bed. Didn't this have a? I seem to remember this having a spiral on it. Maybe no, that was a different bed. Okay. Uh. Anything over there? It's not dissimilar to the, how Cassie's collection is laid out, you know. Okay. Um. Hmm. Let's see. 
see. Is there... Like, can I get out on that, maybe? I don't see any cards, or really any places to, uh... To go. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, spotted! I absolutely do see a card. Hold on. Literally spotted. Barely, but spotted. Hell yeah. Oh, that feels good. 27 out of 27. It was kind of clipping into the rock, too. Hell yeah. I'm glad that didn't take too long. I actually got to find that one on my own, too. Sweet. Alright. Uh, that's that's all we need to do in this area. That's, that's it. Yep. Think. Let's check the thing. Nice. Green Needle Gulch. Check mark. Satisfying. Questionable area. Uh, let's see. What's my status there? That's probably, yeah, that's probably going to take a little while. I still haven't even done the side quest where you do the little computers. Weird. What is up with and tipping? Remember, remember everything you used to know about wonder and tipping. Okay. Tipping money or tipping in the English sense? I'm going to assume tipping money. Uh, yeah, so all the rest of these are probably going to take a little while. Yeah. That'll be next stream. But this was fun. This was a pretty good time. It's useful having chat here to be like, hey, you missed a figment. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> You guys know I'm not a huge fan of people saying that sort of shit, but at the same time, I mean, I can't deny it saved me some consternation at this, uh, in, in this particular instance. I'm kind of sad, uh... Do we even get to see... Actually, hold on. Let me go up to this guy's, like, tree house. I want to see Helmut Fullbear's full body. I don't know if he's actually here, but, uh... We only talked to Bob in his mind. And I want to go talk to Bob again, as long as I'm here. He was the, he was the last, last NPC that I didn't have a little chat with. And I want to see if him and Helmut are, are sitting in here making out. I think there were leaves earlier that I just missed. check and see what's even, like, in this room, if anything has changed. Good. Good All door. Oh, sad. Notes. Gone to Grulovia. It's this picture. picture of the psychic six. Huh. I mean seven. Sad. Okay. I guess we'll do that next time. That, that'll be our little bit of suspense. I cut it. Kind of have a feeling they won't because of that one voice line, but I could be wrong. It's not like it would be difficult from a gameplay perspective to just, you know, bring his 3D model back in. But okie doke. Mr. Pokey Lope. Okie dokie. Oh, right, it's outdoors. Otto's just here. He just runs the things. He just does all of the things. He has the automatic and he has the, the autobahn. His name is made for puns. Ah, uh, yes. Truman's Grotto. The quarry. Oh, God. Yeah, the, the, getting some of the last few things is going to be tricky. But, uh... Next stream will be the last Psychonauts 2 stream, probably. Actually, oh. There's also the potential that I will be doing, that I'll be replaying part of the game to get a couple more achievements, but we'll see. Because the one... Talk to Mia in her office is one of the achievements, and I think I might need to re replay the very beginning of the game in order to do that. Because I think she is not here now. 
At the very least, I was able to get the, uh, help Dion set up the Aquatodome thing, even after he was long gone, which was very jank. There's some sloppy aspects of the, like, 100%ing of this game. Some of those figments in Bob's world were just, like, bruh, too. But for the most part, still fun. Still a fun game to fuck around in. I really liked the, uh, the spinning. <laughs> That was, that was fun. I might need to fuck around with that more off stream, and if I find anything fun with it, I'll let you guys know next stream. I'll have to go back into Fatherland Follies and poke around. But very, very fun. Still enjoying the game. Just about ready for it to be done, which is good, because it's just about to be done. Thanks for watching, everyone.